Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West, where this might be the last episode I do for a little bit at least, um, because I don't have much more time to record. <laughs> so I'll hopefully be able to get these edited and up tonight for at least a two weeks while I've got, we'll see. And then I'll still be, I'll still be wandering around, so I might not be able to play for like another month or so. Um, I need to go north, I want to go north. Um, but yeah, so let's let's give it all we've got, you know. But I'm distracted. I could go in there. I could go up here. Huh? I had something I was gonna say. Of course I did. And as soon as I started talking, I freaking can't remember. Um. There it is! There's the Golden Gate Bridge! I was sitting here trying to think of what I still... That looks like an a fighting arena. I, was... I thought I saw something in the water. <sighs> there she is! The Golden Gate Bridge! Let's go get her! Maybe this is the tower to the northwest of the island where that guy is. That's good. Um... Bullet. Oh, I was going to say, I, it has been significantly more fun after having taken a break. Oh, that's cool. Uh, after having taken a break and also, like, liberating myself from feeling like I needed to do a bunch of the, like, side quests, which I wanted to do, like, and I still would like to do them eventually, you know? Like, the collectibles and stuff, but it was just so stressful thinking I had to get them all done, like, to myself thinking that I had to get done before I did the but before I did the main mission but doing that main mission was awesome and it just is a lot more liberating honestly like I just I feel much better having made that decision officially I'm not even gonna do like one or two of them I'm not even gonna do the tall necks like I'm just I'm just gonna play I'm gonna do the side quests I want and I'm gonna play the main mission <laughs> and it's very very good makes me a lot more happy so hopefully it's noticeable <laughs> I think it has been I also got my medication which has been nice made me a bit more focused for this bit is this something I should recognize I feel like it is I feel like that that not that tower necessarily must be the tower oh they have sun wings and it's full of sun wings let me fly that can't be good let me fly that that is something maybe I should recognize. Um, is it, I feel like in I was like I feel like there should be stuff to loot in here, and lo and behold, there is. Packs uh, full, but my stash has one. Yeah, good thing we can teleport it there. How great for us! Are there like stuffs? There's a weapons person in. I will actually check this weapon person for a sling. Oh, hello, 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 yes. It was the bow. Adhesive warrior bow and the ice bolt, the ice storm bolt blaster. Don't like those bows. That's right, I do have, I forgot all about the tar, like the adhesive stuff. Heck, <laughs> there's so many things in this game. I am just... I'm trying to see if these guys are the same model. Mm, I don't think so. I think they are not. Okay, because like, just the way they were standing there for a second, and they have... Oh, and they had totally different hairstyles. I thought they had similar hairstyles. Well, they do. They got the bun. But this guy's got the braid on the front. And this guy just has poofy hair. And he's got the things in the back, and this guy does. Okay. I was like, mm, this game has never done that as far as I know. <laughs> but I, you know, you play like Mass Effect, and you're like, or uh, what was it? Andromeda did it too a lot, where like they would just have like the four of the same guy model, and it was like the same white guy with a freaking mullet. And it was like, whoa. <gasps> 
real manta ray. That's a snap one. Oh, but this fish. I, I can grab this fish. It's a moon fish, probably. Come here. Where'd it go? Oh, 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 I need to. I was like, wait, where am I going? But I need to switch quests so that I don't lose myself. Uh, oh, the wings of the ten. I think, how do I finish the wings of the ten? Does Kotalo have to get both his arms back? Or one his one arm back? <laughs> he already has the other one still. Um. Okay. It's over there. This is gorgeous. It is absolutely gorgeous. There is a, definitely a machine up there. What's that? Come here, fish. Let me have you. This is all water fish. It wasn't even a moon fish. Ooh. Come on. Aloy, I'm I'm gonna make freaking lose it. Is this am I even supposed to be in here? Oh, well, what do you mean? A trolley! It's a San Francisco trolley! I do remember seeing those now. And even if you haven't, you maybe I actually haven't, I've just seen them in movies so often. A San Francisco trolley! Come on, this is 100% climbable stuff. Like, I, I don't understand. Like, I've never had an issue really with this stuff before that I know of. There's probably like a library or something. Another trolley! Oh, it's so weird to see. I was obsessed with, like, apocalyptic movies as a teenager. It's never quite left. Oh, this is beautiful. It's never quite left. <laughs> I, uh, but now that I've gotten older, it seems a little too real in some ways, some of these uh, apocalyptic scenarios. And I'm like, oh, I don't want to watch it anymore. But I always have a great fondness for the movies I watched. Nothing crazy, but, like, I watched most of that. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Oh, with the birds and everything. You guys, it's gorgeous. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. That is so, so cool. I am barely distracted. What? I heard stuff. What? I'm sorry, I'm like tracking this question mark. Oh, hey. The bombardment. The lump. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. I mean, that is one of those things. Those virtual life mm -hmm. AI reality it's things. People are like, it sounds cool, and they don't realize that there are, oh my gosh, real dangers, you know? I mean, they do. Like, people are like, oh, we could have told you that, like, Pokemon Go would have had issues right out the gate with safety. And people were like, no, but it was fascinating to watch people. Yeah, yeah, I'll let you out.
But yeah, I can imagine something like Pokemon Go, but like times 100. <laughs> Pokemon Go wasn't too bad, but I did collect uh, like articles for a while about like the amount of people who died or were severely injured doing something while not paying attention and playing Pokemon Go. I loved it. Oh my gosh. Okay. It looked like a plane from above. It's one of those black boxes, probably. I can Oops. find a voice recording here. Is it gonna be easy? Oh my gosh, it is. Oh, no. We just cut the Harrison too. The remaining ships are concentrating their fire on the lead horse, but there must be six more coming in behind it. And there are several ashore and moving inland and further up the coast. Copy that. We'll keep eyes on it. But whatever the Zero Dawn super weapon is, you'd better use it soon or there'll be nothing left. Yeah. Final secret. Was no weapon. Just hope that life could survive. Well, that was. There must be another flight recorder transmitting a signal. It was remarkably easy. Some of them were requiring like intense puzzling. Is this is this where I'm supposed to be? Nope. <laughs> Uh, but I think I should go this way. It's so eerie in this, like, misty nighttime vibe. Like, look at that. Is that a cathedral? Should I recognize it? I feel like I should recognize this as like a cathedral of some sort. Poor San Francisco, the only thing you see about it in the movies is the bridge and the trolleys. Yeah, this has to be a cathedral. Look at that, like, gothic design. Well here, for people who know anything about San Francisco, here's a cool cathedral that you probably know the name of, but I don't. Is it just, I was like, I feel like there's gotta be a recording in here, but. Can I? Oh, that was weird. Yeah, I think going down with the with the thing on meant that it stayed up like it does on land, but when it's underwater it generally just sends out a pulse, so it started doing both. Well, that's really cool. It's very gorgeous. You know what they should do? They should give us machines that swim that we can ride. I want to ride a manta ray machine. Oh, hello. Don't mind me. No, really don't. Really don't. Really don't. Really don't. Really don't. It's gonna be hard enough to fight the sun wings. What kind of creatures you guys got here? I don't have the override data for that machine yet. This is it very hard to see anything. This whole place is very covered in greenery and maybe if I was oh there's a machine I hadn't really seen any of them like uh, any of the old machines the old Ted Farrell machines
Oh, wait. Any scouts made it to that tower. I doubt the Sunwings up there missed them. What Sunwings? I should check the place for survivors. I, well, that's not what I'm... Yeah, the tower, okay. Well, why is it... Search land. Well, I mean, I could go down there. Or I could just go up here to the tower. If I'm doing this out of order, I'll be very upset. He's getting. I have a weapon just for you. Show yourself. Ah. Oh, I thought it died. Trying to hit it. Okay. I was pressing the wrong button for that. I know, but we also have sun wings. What the heck? Oh my gosh, come back. Okay. 
good. All right, time to climb. Data to override that machine oh. might be in another cauldron. What is? Oh my gosh, is that a sunwing that scared the crap out of me? All right, I'm just gonna maybe climb if I can see. I can't see. Oh, can you see into here? That's uh, cool. This tower. Oh, man. Oh, and I can't make any more. Maybe we'll do explosive things. Oh, you can hit me through the trees, but I can't hit you through the tree. Tower. Unfair. You know how I love climbing puzzles? It's going to be super great in the dark. Dead end. Oh boy. Maybe if I go outside, I can find another one. Oh, that like teleported me there. I'm scared. This is very Assassin's creed -y. One wrong move, and I could just throw myself off the building. Oh, another close one. <laughs> I don't know how we're still alive, honestly, just from the climbing alone. And they put a big giant hole in the center just to screw you over. They're like, oh, you got all the way here? Ooh, I almost puked right there. I was gonna scream. Oh, no, why did we go down? Just jump across. Jump across. I, I don't know why we're going in circles like this. One scout, but there's only one way oh. to be sure it's Jomar's brother. Better check for the relic. <sighs> the relic. It is. And my focus picked up data on it. It's not a beacon. It's a tourist map of San Francisco. If the Quen could read this, they wouldn't need to send scouts out blind. I should tell Alva. Aloy! I'm here. Alva. I found some data I think Bohai might be interested in seeing. I'm sending it to you now. I'll pass it along. Thanks. I better take this relic back with me. Give it back to Jomar. Along with the bad news. By the looks of things. Whoever was with Horus must have met a similar fate. Mm, or I could go look, I guess? It's, it still has that as an option. And... I don't know, I guess this one wasn't quite as involved. It did sound like the way he's like, If you find him, could you bring the relic back? I'm like, oh, he's dead. He did. 
but you know, you can always hope. Well, let's just. Oh well, there were a lot of. There were machines. Hiding in. But. Yeah, don't, don't, don't worry about it. Apex. Apex Red Eye Watcher. Cool beans. Well, I don't see people. I'm trying to see if any of these are bodies. Plasma will do a lot of damage here. Run around the beach. Is this where? Why is it? Oh, it put me back. Okay, I was like, I don't know what you want from me. The rest of the scale of the Did I find Except them? Cool, because I didn't actually machines. see them. Horus must have escaped to the tower. Too bad machines got away. Alright, so we did. I like I would feel bad if we only looked for the one guy. Oh, there's somebody. And then didn't get closure on the others. Um also why are they sending out scouting par parties with no armor? Like it looks like they definitely have some sort of cast system. Where, like, some people are allowed armor and some aren't. Like, even scouts usually have armor, you know? So they couldn't just be scouts and warriors. Or soldiers. Well, I guess we can... Save a little bit on time. I selected that quest, so I don't know why it's not the one glowing yellow. Like, why it switched over to the main quest. It's sort of sad, honestly, right? That, like, he was carrying oh, what, the sweat. like, would have kept him alive around his neck the whole time. But, you know. I think at least the guy got to see San Francisco. And maybe, of all places, it's not a bad place to die in the place you loved, I guess? I don't know. But, you know, you wish he could have seen more of it, you know? Um, and to die by Sunwing sounds pretty terrible, honestly. Did you? I'm sorry. How did he die? The tower was a Sunwing nest. He went in there looking for cover, but... He was holding on to that when I found him. Horus. I read the data on it. It had a map that can help your people get the lay of the land without risking more scouts. All of us sharing it with Bohai right now. It's a good thing your brother protected it. I'd trade all the data in the legacy to have my little brother back. I'm glad that something meaningful came from his death. As promised, you now have access to my weapon stock. If you bring me the right resources, I can make you anything you see there. Actually, why don't you give this a try? Uh, One of our best. I love they just... For use, you know where to find more. They just hand me things. I'm really sorry for your loss. I know you are. And I'm grateful. Well, and this feels weird. An elite canister roadcaster. This feels weird to, like, um... Like, turn around and be like, and now let's trade. You know what I mean? <laughs> Jeez, okay. Plasma, ice, and acid. Well. Well, howdy doody. Hey. Hi. Go 
go. Oh, calm down. Oh. Oh, it only has little plasma bolts. But it has. Deadly, the long range type, but delivers devastating plasma payloads that can prime a target for a plasma blast or detonate glow blast canisters, but you also have terror arrows on there. Plus 10% component terror upgrade. Oh! Are those like bouncing <laughs> bombs? A Delver's best friend? No. Pulverizing spike thrower. I wanted to like the spike thrower more, but the explosives generally damage things that I'm trying to get off of machines, and it's expensive to make. Damaging and tearing into target. High ground damage bonus. Um. Why? Another time then. Why? Do you guys only have to knock stuff? Hmm. Where's your own weaponry? And armament. Let's see. I do want to go explore the west side of the island. But, right now, we gotta call this episode here, I think. So, hopefully when I get back, I will remember... Where am I? Hopefully I will remember that I did want to explore a bit more. No, wait, really. Oh, okay, I was gonna look. I was looking for the campfire. But yes, thank you all for joining me. I've been recording all day. Like my voice is starting to go a little bit from it. But it's been nice to sit down and record this honestly and like make good progress on like a, like a definitive goal. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you soon. Don't have too big of a gap between episode uploads, but I can never promise that. So, thank you guys again for watching. Really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Reese Guido, my sapling tier patron, and Adam, my other sapling tier patron. Thank you guys so, so much for your support. I really appreciate it. And an extra special shout out to Christopher, my tree tier patron, who is the super bestest and who I super duper appreciate. So, thank you again, and I hope to see you guys in the next one.